The High Technology Foundation is headquartered in the I-79 Technology Park in Fairmont, West Virginia. With its state-of-the-art facilities, advanced electrical system, satellite ground system capability, and high-speed fiber optic connectivity, the I-79 Technology Park's infrastructure matches and or exceeds the leading technology parks in the country. The framework has been established to ensure future development and growth. Its mission is to provide innovative technology-based programs, products, and services to the global marketplace. As we look inside the Robert H. Mollahan Research Center, we will see the Foundation's vision of being a vibrant national technology organization that's driven by knowledge, excellence, and innovation with West Virginia values and global capabilities. The Robert H. Mollahan Research Center houses the WVU NASA Robotics Technology Center, which is a simulation facility that tests robotic operations for satellite service and procedures for NASA. The facility holds a large-scale grapple arm that measures 30 feet in length. The arm was used to carry cargo to the International Space Station. The arm is unable to support its own weight, so it floats on compressed air. The facility also holds multiple robotic platforms, including some that test robotic satellite service and procedures. Here, workers develop technology that allows these robotics to think, feel, and see for themselves. One project the High Tech Foundation is working on involves a sensor that detects explosives. Employees are developing lasers and working with spectrometers and deep ultraviolet light to create a compact device for detecting explosives. The Robert H. Mollahan Research Center is also home to one of the most advanced supercomputer facilities in the world. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration has competitively chosen Fairmont, West Virginia as one of its newest strategic locations. In addition to the Supercomputer Center, the Robert H. Mollahan Research Center is home to two of the nation's most important satellite ground stations. Fairmont will play a vital role in helping NOAA achieve its mission. NOAA is the nation's number one resource for weather information which is essential for ensuring the safety of lives and property. One of the more interesting machines at the research center holds digital tapes of weather records. When a person requests certain data, an arm finds that tape, pulls it from its storage, and transfers the data to the person who requested it. From space robotics and lasers to supercomputers, the I-79 Technology Park provides innovative technology-based programs, products, and services to the global marketplace. The High Technology Foundation also works closely with the community by providing educational presentations to schools and exposing those students to the technology field of study. I'm Susan Kilrain. I've uh, flown in space twice as a pilot of the Space Shuttle Columbia. And I'm here in Fairmont, West Virginia, talking to school kids, mostly fifth and sixth graders, trying to encourage them to fulfill their dreams and perhaps go into STEM areas, math, science, technology, and and engineering, like I did. I went into engineering and then I later became an astronaut. For more information about the High Tech Foundation, visit their website, www.wvhtf.org.